I remember eight years ago, we had a discussion about should he wear glasses. We looked at a lot of different glasses, and, and we chose a browner version of these. Hold on, I'm not sure these glasses are clean. I'll clean them. There you go. There, there I am. I'm Saul now. <laughs> I remember it was my birthday. My agent called, said, you're going to be offered something in the morning. I'm sending it over to you. Uh, look at it. I read this thing, and uh, it was clearly of high quality with the potential, as they say in the television business, to have a very slow onion peel. I have been playing Saul Berenson since that phone call, only having let him slowly drift away when we finished Saul's final shot. But he'll be with me forever because I couldn't leave him behind. He had a great influence on me. He taught me how to listen. He taught me how to be quieter. He taught me how to be kinder. If I was standing in front of Saul Berenson today, I would say thank you. You have given me countless gifts. It has been one of the privileges of my life, and I cannot thank Saul Berenson, our writers, Claire, and most of all, our audience, for letting Mandy, through Saul, have that privilege.